good morning, friends. We have another fun show ready for you today on Indie Now, starting with a four-day event that you can attend that features comedy, music, local food vendors. We're gonna tell you all about the Middle Ground Comedy Festival kicking off tomorrow. It's going to be so much fun. Plus, we are getting a preview of the official Colts draft party and all the festivities taking place this weekend. We're even getting a look at the fun Colts fashion and the latest gear. Sounds fun. And the Culinary Crossroads Spring Dinner Series is back, featuring great food for a great cause. We're gonna show you how you can check out the multi-course menu yourself. All right, Indy now. now starts now. now. This is Indy Now. Cheers, buddy. Well, hey. Really liking the, the, the straight hair today. I know I mentioned that in the tease, but it's, it's nice. Bit. I yeah. love your jacket. That color yeah. really just pops. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. It's compliment hour here. It's been a weird morning, actually. It's been fun. It's been a really fun. Fun, but weird. Morning. We were uh, yes. we were reminiscing with our producers, Kerrigan and Abby. We got pretty nostalgic, like early. We did. So I saw a comedy special last night that Seth Rogen created, and the Muppets showed up in it. And the Muppets made me and my wife, Lauren, cry last night on the couch. Yeah. It's got teary eyed. Oh, it's talking full on weeping. It was misty. It was misty. It was, misty. It was kind of like I can't talk for a sec because I'm going to crack. Like, it's um, happening. It took us both back to like the innocent childhood time, like a Saturday morning. The living room is aglow with oh. sunlight. So I got to meet Elmo when uh, when I was in Straight No Chaser. We got to sing at the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade back in like 2010, oh, maybe. My goodness. And we met Elmo. Um, and you can barely see the hand of, of the guy that created Elmo, but I became a child when that little puppet was on my shoulder. Man. You can just see the joy in your face there. It was so fun. Yeah, Elmo tried to eat my head, laugh together. Uh, it was fun. Goodness. But yeah, last night it, it, we, we got a little tender. You got, you got a little tender. You yeah. got a little tender. Tommy tender pants. Oh. But it was fun. Uh, we had a good time. And, uh, oh, we always like to start things off. On a good, good note. note. We do. We really do. Even when the graphic goes before we're ready. It just it just ran today. Did Justin run that? Justin said, you know what, you're done. Yeah, he's like, just run the graphic. Thanks, you're Justin. Done. Thank you. Love yes. you. <laughs> well, uh, guys, a local health care team from <laughs> from the can we get off Elmo? There we go. Okay, so a local healthcare team from the Indiana Hemophilia and Thrombosis Center returned this past weekend from a two week trip to Kenya where they provided care to people who suffer from blood disorders and they don't have the specialized care that we do here in the States. That's right. And so it's estimated that more than 4,000 people in Kenya have been born with this, yet less than 1,000 have been identified as receiving treatment for it. So the team trained local medical staff. They helped over 100 patients on that trip. Doing great work. And if you would like to learn more or donate to the cause, you can go to ampathkenya.org. And if you add a slash donate to that, you can uh, go to their fundraising page. So good on them. I know, I love yeah. our On a Good Note stories, just always yeah. highlighting positive things. And Hoosiers today we have, doing great things in the world. Yes. Yeah. And today we have such a fun show. Yeah, we're kicking it off with some laughter. With some laughter. So, so there is an amazing comedy festival coming here to our area. So we're kicking off the show to tell you all about it. And we've got two incredible local comedians here yes. with us today. We have Dwight and Gwen. Hi, guys. Hi. What's up? How you doing? We're from Comedy Hi. Fest. How, How are you guys? So Good happy to, see to be here. here. Good to see you. This Good really to sounds fun. Oh, this festival yeah, sounds awesome. It's it's going to be a blast. All right, so tell us all about it. What's happening? Who's going to be there? What can people see? Yeah, so with Middle Ground Comedy Festival taking place the 27th through the 30th at Black Circle Brewing. And we're going to have comedian, 45 comedians from across the country coming into the city. Wow. Um, just to do, you know, back to back to back to back shows. Yeah. Um, it's going to be a lot of fun. We've got some musical acts closing out Friday and Saturday night. So it'll be like a big party. And Saturday we're having a vendor fair with some local artists. So fun. Um, yeah, it's going to be a lot 45 of fun. 45 comics. That's a lot. It's a lot of comics from all over the country, too, so you wow. get a little bit of mix of everything. Yeah. It's really good vibes. Yeah. Cool. You get a little comedy, you get a little music. A little it's going to be everything. awesome. Yeah. And it's fun to have a festival like this in the Midwest. Yeah. yeah. You know, Absolutely. to have an event that people can check out. I know you brought some samples here, maybe some of the things you can check out. Yeah, so we've got some uh, Black Circle beer here. We have some Goat Ranch, which is from uh, Big Lug Brewing. They're okay. one of our sponsors. Oh, wow. Um, Very and nice then, display. Yeah. Feel the power. Thank you. Feel that. Yeah. 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 That Are you going to crack yeah. that open? That is a hefty beer. That's like Actually, a curl, curls, man. That's a that. metric That's leader. 32 ha ounces of happiness. <laughs> Good <for> night. <laughs> so this is a crowler. So this yeah. is like two and a half beers. So you can get fresh yeah, beer. Yeah, get in there. It's like the size um, of Jillian's head. Really, yeah. <laughs> okay. 
<laughs> All right, well. well so, and then the other is ten, Pixel ten, 5, we're good. 10.05, I think, 10 yeah. 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 <laughs> beer the Morning beer, that's yeah. great. Yeah. Yeah. You have to smash those on your oh, yeah. forehead. That's good stuff uh, right there. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so. That's nice. Oh, that is that's a good sip. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, it is refreshing. Well, now, yeah, now I'm prepared to go on with the rest of the show. Perfect. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. What made you guys want to be involved in this event? We love bringing communities together, so yeah. just like um, people from across you know, artistic genres, people who have different skills, different interests, um, and then bringing people who just have a different voice and a different perspective to the comedy stages in Indianapolis was so important to all of us. That's Dwight, what yeah. about you? It's been cool to like start comedy here and kind of grow my career here. Yeah. So to see what the Middle Ground Comedy Festival team has done with bringing communities together, especially at Black Circle, which yeah. is all about bringing communities together right. uh, for a great weekend. It's just uh, something I'm really excited to be a part Sounds of. Sounds like a lot of fun. Yeah, yeah. fun Food, venue, comedy, too. drinks, food, yeah. art, got all kinds yeah. of stuff. You can I'll sing. bring an Elmo doll for you if oh you want. Oh my gosh. Like, come on, man. <laughs> yeah. I will. We'll get you out there. there. I will. Yes. Uh, you can, yes. <laughs> everything. You can use the promo code LOL to get $5 off this. Uh, the tickets. Uh, you can go to Eventbrite and then search for Middle Ground Comedy Festival and use that code. Okay. LOL. So, Normally we play our Indie Now pop quiz trivia game at the end of our shows, okay. but we were figuring since you guys are so fun and love to have a great time, oh, will you it. play it with us? Would you be Absolutely. down? Would you okay. Be down? Yeah. okay. Yes. All right. Let's go. Now we're very competitive. Yes. Good. So. Bring it. Okay. Bring it. Okay. Ryan is. So, <laughs> so yeah. hands behind the back. Okay. 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 Producer Abby is going to read questions. It will be on the screen if you need, okay. uh, and then just ding in and answer. Here I feel we go. bad just that we have in. these beers and you don't even have them. How rude. Oh. Well, we'll make up for lost time this week. Perfect. Those were to share. Yeah. Were to oh. <laughs> oh, go for it. It's a long show, right? Sorry, Grant. <laughs> you know, He's finished. I feel that. terrible. Yeah. Anyway. Okay, first question, Abby. <laughs> Which iconic actor plays the part of Frank Reynolds in It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia? Gwen. Danny DeVito. Yes. Nice. nice. All right, Gwen's on the board. Okay, okay. all right. Good show. I saw that show. It's a I good show. Wanted to. Yes. It's a good show. All right. Frasier is actually a spinoff of what show? Gwen again. Cheers. Yes. Oh! <laughs> Gwen, she's heating up. Gwen's coming up. out strong. Okay, all right, Gwen. You guys had a couple of drinks. We yeah. Moved a little yeah. yeah. <laughs> Which superhero had a reference or an unwitting cameo in every episode of Seinfeld? I've never seen that show. I think it's Superman. Correct. I don't know how I know that, but. Good job. <laughs> Thank it's you. on the show. Yeah. 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 Is everybody playing for their own that. points, or are we playing against them? Oh, game? now that's a good question. It's okay, oh, so it's man. us against them. Okay. On the board, teammate, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay. okay. All right. We can do the work. We can just, yeah, we can just do the yeah. One to two. Okay. <laughs> okay. Which character from The Big Bang Theory had a spin off show created about his younger years? <laughs> Sheldon. Sheldon. Yes. Good job. Okay. Was, yeah. Can you phone a friend? <laughs> we, we all <laughs> What are that. the rules? Yeah. Uh, you're doing great. Just okay. following them along. I've okay. I've just been sipping. <laughs> <laughs> Jillian's just on spring break circa 2002. Yes. Just living her life. Okay. Bringing nothing to the table. <laughs> what sitcom repeatedly features the line, we were on a break? Oh, um, Fred. There it Correct. Is. Come on, yes. teammate. Yeah. Yeah. Proud of you. Yeah. Proud of you. Coming Three to two. In. They're up by one. Yeah, yeah. We got to yeah. yeah. tie this up. Come on, team middle ground forever. Yeah. I love that. What comedian pretends to be an old British nanny in Mrs. Doubtfire? Oh, get it. Uh, comedian? Robin Williams. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Hello. Oh. One of my favorite actors. We're tied up, guys. Oh, 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 it's on the okay. line. Okay. So close. Okay. Yeah, but the hand behind the back rule. Really. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, you got to do it. I'm not really falling. Sorry. I need to, yeah. What sport does the dude like to play in the Big Lebowski? Dude. Bowling. Yes. He does. Yes. Dwight. Yes. Nice job, Dwight. Okay. Do we have we have more questions? <laughs> no quotes on yes. here. <laughs> Who played the title character in the Forty Year Old Virgin? Ah, dang it. Steve Carell. Yes. Uh, are they oh, up by two? I think look they're up at by two. Dwight just yeah. got like heating up. He got sneaky. He's <laughs> well, like, well, it's down on yeah, it's yeah. 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 Okay, a comedy genre. Yes. If they were asking it. news questions. <laughs> <laughs> Us too, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> Which character becomes a wanted fugitive during the final season of The Office? Uh, Creed Bratton? Yes. Come on. Nice. Nice. Let's go. Creed. Yeah, yeah. Creed's Last question. Creed's an underrated character. Okay, here we go. Who played Ferris Bueller in Ferris Bueller's Day Off? Uh, oh, Matthew. I don't know. Uh, I've never seen it. Matthew. I've never seen it. Feel it. Matthew. Yes. Matthew. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Gwen and Gwen. <laughs> okay, guys, you, you, you don't have to gloat. That was, that was amazing. Oh. You don't have to gloat. Yeah. You guys, check it out. Go to Middle Ground. Uh, the comedy festival <laughs> happening there at Black Circle. There's the link where you can get tickets. Don't you forget to use the code LOL to get $5 off. Guys, That's thanks right. so and much for And you can see them the perform. Appreciate you guys. Yes. 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 So check them out. Yep. Come hey, see us. really quick, tell people how they can find both of you. Oh, yeah. Yes. I'm just at DwightSimmons.com. Yes. And I'm at GwenSunkle.com. Perfect. Thank okay. you. And check Love them it. out at the comedy festival. Thank you both so much. You killed it. Really yeah. appreciate Great it. Great job, guys. Thanks. Hey, coming up next, Chef Jonathan Brooks from Beholder and Milktooth restaurants are going to tell us what you can experience at Culinary Crossroads Spring Dinner that's happening next Monday night. That's right. We're talking great food, a great cause, and how you can check it out. We'll be right back. Look at the size of this.